more power, more of you in my life, more love, more power, more of you in my life, I will worship you with all of my heart, I will worship you. Somebody say I gotta lose me to gain Let that song repeat. I didn't even know that was the version of what I was going to be singing. Lord, help Aunt Geraldine lose everything to gain the more of you. I'm not praying you win or gain anything in that. I'm praying you lose anything that would hinder more of him. Lord, let there be a loss of anything that would hinder more of him. He led the most time. Most time people come to the altar to pray for something, to get something. Tonight, say, Lord, help me to lose something. I'm going to tell you what, it's usually not demons that hinder us from getting closer to God. It's the vices that set up as strongholds in our minds. Because we're not willing to be like Paul to forget it, to lose it. says you have my respect for I have respect unto the lowly Psalm 138 6 that means he looks God says you got my attention and I know it's hard and I know it's a struggle and I know it's a sacrifice but follow what I told you to do go the distance As God says I'm about to take you further than you've ever been in me and that's why I'm requiring it this season a sacrifice. Woo! Hallelujah! Fill him up, Holy Ghost. Here comes his fire. Yeah, Lord. He said, I won't disappoint you no more. Fill him up, Lord, with your holy God, your holy fire. Yeah. 
this Lord hallelujah more 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 hallelujah more of you in my life I won't send you empty away. No, I won't send you empty away. Fill him up. Fill him holy, holy, holy. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus. He'll not disappoint you tonight. Oh, he'll not send you away. Come, Holy Ghost, come, Spirit of burning Isaiah 4 4. Come, Spirit of the Lord, like fire. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, receive. Here he comes like fire, here he comes like fire. Burn, Spirit of the living God. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Jesus. Holy fire, holy fire. Holy fire, holy fire, Lord. Yes, in the name of Jesus. Oh, I delivered you from religion, says the Lord. Yes, I did. I delivered you from religion to follow me into the fire. Woo, yes, hello. Sarah Blaze, holy Lord, let your fire burn, let your fire burn, let your Holy Ghost move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go deep, Lord, tonight. Let your presence mm, saturate every part of her life, God, as she yields and as she hungers for you. Touch. Jesus, yes, Lord, in the end of the holy, 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 God, can I experience you again like I did? You can. Lift your hands. God says, I exceed my greatness. Hey! Yes, I exceed my greatness. Ephesians 1, 19. In the name of Jesus, Lord, touch your God with your fire tonight. Lay your hand on the light. God, let her know. Stand there with your hands down. 
You say if that was a thousand dollars, and I said I want you to receive this, would you stand there and just watch? But yet that's what we do in the kingdom of God. Paul said a reach. Paul said a reach. Philippians three thirteen. He said a reach. I reach. Somebody say you gotta reach. And when you reach, you receive. When you reach, you receive. Yes, in the name. Come, 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 Lord. In the name of Jesus. Woo, let your hands, Tyler. Receive. Receive. Now. Yeah, receive. Yes, the Holy Ghost. Lift your hands, Lord. Receive. Now. In the name. Jesus, Lord, let your fire fall. Let your Holy Ghost come down like fire. Somebody say receive. The receivers are the reachers. Receive fire. says you're going to begin to feel my fire on your right hand. Whew. Don't wait to shout and praise me when you feel it. But when you feel it, go touch somebody. Go pray. They bless Hey, hey. Hey, in the name of Jesus. like that you got in your hand right there. Throw it down. God said that's how you lose it. Lose it. Lose it. If what you couldn't get no other way, that's how you get it. Lord, right now in the name of Jesus. God, I declare to be Hosea. Jesus. Ooh, in the name of the Lord. We need our faith to do kind of like what she does when she sees Pastor Marvin every service. He runs and jumps in the arms. It's telling her daddy and mama this morning, I've learned to brace myself and expect it. But when she did it this morning, I said, Lord, that's why we need to be in the spirit when it comes to doing for God. Go after God. Somebody said, run to him and jump in his arms. Holy Ghost, bless her, Lord. Use you're doing now, Lord, did you like us? In the name of Jesus, 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 name of Jesus, Lord, I'm reaching, Lord, I'm reaching, I'll reach forth to that which is before Philippians 3.13. Somebody say, if you're going to get what God wants to do you gotta reach for it you gotta stretch somebody say the stretch don't feel good in the spirit I've trained myself you won't see me sit stand on this stage and not praise it hear me not do what I hear being sung in a song about it. Boy, that Marvin Booth feels God all the time. No, he don't. He's just learned to feel after God. I make myself shout. 
because of the cross I make myself reach up because of the cross I make myself sometimes I start dancing I don't feel nothing but I'm after him and I'm dancing before the Lord with all my might first Samuel 6 14 I don't wait to feel something I, hallelujah I ain't got to feel something I, I already know what he did for me at the cross I, hallelujah and I said Lord I want to dance for you I, Lord I want to praise you and I just start doing it I, sometimes I feel so bad I don't feel like nothing I, oh glory to God I, but after I start feeling after him then I feel it and that's what we got to understand we got to stop living by our feelings and start feeling after God Acts 17 27 because when we feel after him that's when we'll begin to feel religion reclines relationship with God reaches it disciplines itself to say hallelujah. It disciplines itself to say thank you, Jesus. It disciplines itself and it hears truth. Stand up and do that right there. Come on, anybody hear the Holy Ghost? Don't you for one moment think that people that you see doing that all the time feel it. It ain't about feeling it. But I promise you, if you ever do, you'll start feeling it. Oh, hallelujah. And religion has taught us that that's flesh. And don't pinch nobody, but pinch yourself. Now, guess what? We all in the flesh. Praise always begins in the flesh. Some people never know what it means to worship in the spirit because they don't know how to praise God in the flesh. What's that mean? That means when David danced before the Lord, he did it with all his might. He made a decision because he's worthy. I'm going to give him praise. Amen. Praise ain't something God takes. It's a gift we give. So if we give it, we do it. Hello? We think praising God's when the Holy Ghost hits somebody and they start jerking and jolting and jumping and going all that. No, they've been doing something prior to that. <laughs> That's just a manifestation that follows. Amen. Hallelujah. Y'all see me sometimes in the spirit like that. I'll I just start dancing for the Lord and then all of a sudden the Holy Ghost hits me and you watch my dance even change. Huh. Somebody spoke on YouTube the other day. They said, boy, the white boy got moves. I was thinking, Lord, open their eyes. This ain't about a white boy, black boy, brown boy, whatever color boy. It's about God. I was dancing in the spirit. Amen. Somebody said, that's the original break dance. Dancing to break through. <laughs> Hallelujah. See, he popping. I'm a poppus, I'm popping. Yeah, believe me or not, there's a lot of stuff pops, but hallelujah. Amen. But everybody say, praise is what I do as an act of my will. David said, I will praise the Lord. I will praise my God. Psalms 118, 28, somebody say, I will. Your will always has to activate a praise. And you must start there if you're ever going to worship in the spirit. There's a place in the spirit you get to worship in God, you forget who's around you. You don't care what time it is. You don't care what's happening. You just, somebody say, you lose your mind. You lose all state of where you are. There's been times I've opened my eyes and I said, oh Lord, I'm here. I didn't realize. I left. I literally felt like I left the room. Heard of Elvis leaving the building? Marvin leaves it sometime. <laughs> hey, man, praise God. Amen. You get caught up in the spirit. But somebody say you'll never live there if you don't learn to discipline yourself how to praise him with all your might. With all your strength. Amen. Oh, and I feel something, I'll clap. That is flesh. Mm. People at ball games, they don't start clapping when they see a score. They see their team and they go crazy. You know? Cheerleaders come out. Ah! You know? And if you need to see the score, it's posted every time you come in. We win. That ought to make you shout every time you walk in when you look at the cross. Why? Because he ain't on it. He ain't in the tomb either. He's coming. Oh, hallelujah. 
Can you say anything then? Think I said it for all of us. Amen. Well, the Bible said when Jesus had left speaking <laughs> in Luke 5, then he told them, launch out in the deep. So as we leave from preaching tonight, that's my word to you. Launch out into the deep. Don't get satisfied with religious shallows. Tiptoeing around in man's traditions. Some ought to say, get in the God over your head. Some ought to say, go swimming for Jesus. And what Peter did, he in John 21, he jumped out of the boat. He said, I ain't waiting for him to tell me I can walk on the water. I ain't looking for a miracle. I want the master. He jumped in the water. He didn't care to walk on it. He, he, he done walked on it before he sank in it too, but he walked on it. But he didn't care to walk on it. If that's the master, I want him more than I want anything from him. And he jumped in the water to swim to it. Somebody said, I had to jump off out there in that deep end. Swim to God. Amen. God to be glory. God, I thank you. Deep calls unto deep at the noise of your water spouts. Your billows, your waves have gone over our head. Psalms 42, verse 7. And Lord, you do want us to get into you over our head. For us to even lose that old mind. To trust in the Lord with all of our heart and lean not to our own understanding. Proverbs 3, 5. And God, I do pray tonight, honestly, for those that have been bound with traditions of men in religiosity. God, that has trapped them and ensnared them even in their way of thinking. And because of that, they're not able to reach out to God. I pray you deliver those who hear this word, who have heard this word, and those that will watch this word in the future. Set them free, Lord, from that so they can experience the raw, real, resurrected Christ in power and in glory. In Jesus' name. And the church says, it's dark.